Where it do was... you go to get a tank? The army? Tanksalot.com. <laughs> had a massive, massive switch of content. Yeah. When, when did it switch? It was about two years ago, was it? Um, I'll, I'll give you the story. Okay, go on. So, go on, here's the story. I mean, how I started on YouTube, I was super lucky. Uh, I was friends with Casper and Joe, and there was all that Was? Group. Well, I am still. I live with Casper. <laughs> yeah, f*** them, now he's um, famous. <laughs> <laughs> um, so that's how I came into it. Like, I got a really easy start and uh, was able to get quite a lot of followers quite quickly. And I was really learning my way... Um, on making videos, learning how it worked, making some bad videos, some good videos. Um, and most of them consisted of like the group of us just playing games and messing mm -hmm. around, which was awesome. Like it was such a great time in my life. And I'm so happy I did it because it taught me so much about creating content. Mm -hmm. And then I suppose in 2019, like that hype started to die down a bit around that group of us. Everyone was sort of moving off into their own directions. Everyone's moved on to different things. Um, but I still wanted to create content. So I started experimenting with some new things. And I started working with a guy named Archie Manners, mm -hmm. who now shares the channel name with me. Um, I met Archie. Well, I saw a video Archie had done online, which I thought was really good. Um, we became friends. Not magic, actually. He... I really like that magic trick. <laughs> Let's try Key Hopkins. <laughs> <laughs> we, we became friends, and then I'd asked him like just to help me out on a couple of videos, which he did, and we worked really well together. Then I started employing him uh, to work for me two days a week, and he was like so incredible. He was meant to be working two days a week, but he was like working seven days a week mm -hmm. just because he loved it so much. Mm -hmm. And then I suppose that came to a pinnacle in uh, January last year when we did the Katie Hopkins video. Mm. And we had a sit down afterwards and a chat and he was like, look, you know, I'm loving this, but realistically I can't keep doing seven days a week on something I'm being paid two days a week mm -hmm. for. So we came up with an agreement to partner up. And since then, it's yeah, it's, it's been amazing. We've done the Carol Baskin video and we've done this Royal Experts video and it's just been awesome. But I suppose that decision to switch the content came early 2019 and it didn't work straight away. Um, we made this video where we took a tank through London as like pretending yeah. it was an Uber. Mm -hmm. That video, so that was the first like really different video I made. It got 14,000 views in two weeks. I was like... Archie, this isn't working. Like, we need to go back to what we know. Mm -hmm. We spent a lot of money on the video. We had to hire a tank. And As you do. It yeah. just completely flopped. How much does a tank cost to hire? Uh, Where do you go to get a tank? The army? Tanksalot.com. <laughs> Is that actually Should a thing? Yeah, that's what we got. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have a look at that's that. We got, but like, it, was, it was so crazy because... <laughs> that's a good pun, actually. It, it had, look. Yeah, 14,000 views after two weeks. And then slowly but surely, it started getting a few more views. And there were these comments, like... Because in the video, I'd said, this is a Challenger 2 tank. And there were these comments going, no, it's not. It's a Scorpion XYZ. <laughs> and I was that like, what? accent is so on point. Yeah, and then it, it turned out that <laughs> it, found, it had found its way into some sort of tank algorithm on YouTube. And all these tanks... Oh, that's so funny. All these tank lovers started watching it. And because they were watching and commenting, it obviously fed it back into YouTube's algorithm and now the video is on like 5 million views or something stupid oh shit after yeah. you've oh. hit the tank stands yeah 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 that's but that, that's really interesting because like you said you could have just quit straight after that like that style content I, want, that. I felt like I needed to start doing something else because I was like Nothing's this working. you know this is maybe I've had my run on YouTube and like this just isn't for me and funnily enough while that video started blowing up a quail egg we'd been trying to hatch in my apartment. Hatched. As you do as well. Was that the supermarket. That was uh, yeah. the supermarket egg. So that was like, you know, I was I was sitting there thinking, okay, you've just uploaded this video for 14,000 views you've spent so much money on. And then I looked over and there are these fucking eggs incubating <laughs> in my flat. And I'm like, you have actually lost your mind. Like Harry Potter under the water. Yeah, you? because it was like, we. I didn't, Archie, to his credit, was like, no, it will work. And I was like, mate, it's not going to work. These eggs aren't, there's not, an egg's not going to hatch. Um, did it hatch? <laughs> it, it, if you didn't know, we made a video where we bought quail eggs from Sainsbury's yes. and put them in an incubator and they ended up hat uh, one of them ended up hatching and turning into a real yeah. quail. And yeah, I thought I'd like gone mad. And then as the tank video started doing well, like the next day, an egg hatched and like everything sort of started coming together. It, isn't it weird how it just switches? Yeah, so weird. I feel like like the, the tanks just come to life and the quails come to life. It was yeah. I, I've got a nice little review from tanksalot.co.uk. Like <laughs> What a refreshing and fun day out with the guys. 
makes a change from the day-to-day -day madness we are living in right now. Recommended to anyone wanting some space, fresh air, fun, and to feel normal again for the day. Normal? Well, normal. 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 So you just get a tank. <laughs> right. I miss my tank. If you do want a tank, please go to tankslot.com. Yeah. It's tanks uh, dash a lot dot co dot uk. Oh, I love yeah. that you were getting all them comments. So it's like, actually, uh, it's got, so that, many. That was kind of like he done a TikTok yesterday taking a piss out of Prince Philip. Yeah. He said he said the Queen said. <laughs> do you know I was? Do you know that comment? That apparently, the royal family was concerned about the oh, the, the comment they released. In, yeah. in response and then yeah. he'd said the Queen said and all the comments were like well actually it wasn't the yeah, Queen and then yeah. I told him he, he was like I'm getting hate on TikTok I was like just own it just pretend that you know and he yeah. started replying to all the comments being like actually I was there she told me uh, I'm actually <laughs> yeah, best mates yeah. with the Queen so <laughs> that's what you should have done you should have went well actually no you're wrong it is this time <laughs> yeah. just double down on it the fact that that got 14,000 views in two weeks which yeah. I find interesting because with my content at the minute um, I'm trying to switch it up a little bit to do videos where um, like you do where it's he was actually inspired by your delivery video by yeah. the way he made a video but, which you deliver poo with the, with, <laughs> yeah with the deliver poo video yeah. that got four, 14k views in a week yeah like, weird um, but the comments and the likes and the engagement is so much higher right. because like the amount of effort was in so I'm yeah. interested to see when you were at that point did you just think listen this, I, I'm, I'm confident that this content is good enough to do well no I, I thought it was bad like at the time when the views were low, I was like, this is a shit video. Like, I couldn't watch it. I would look at it and be like, that's so boring. No wonder it did badly, which is interesting really? to see how just what people thought of the video made my opinion of the video change. Um, but we, I've learned to sort of be more patient since then because a lot of the videos we did after that, uh, like where we sent uh, gravel to influencers and told them mm. it was moon rock mm. and um, put uh, the, the delivery video itself started out quite slowly but then it just steadily grew and grew and now a lot of those videos have gone on to have millions of views but they started at having like 60,000 views in two days or something mm. which is quite different from a lot of YouTubers who you know would probably get most of their views in the first few days so it's interesting how that algorithm can work sometimes. Do you target the algorithm with your videos? No uh, I mean we try and do topical stuff like this Harry and Meghan video and like when we did the fake Ed Sheeran video mm -hmm. um, at KSI and Logan Paul's boxing fight, that's obviously like a massive uh, event. Around, yeah. So we've had so many fucking bangers. What the fuck? Uh, yeah. Shaggy uh, man? Hey. <laughs> I said, turn the cameras off. You're guys. getting jealous, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm just tired that not the old tension's on me. Like, yeah. Everyone should be admiring my looks. I, uh, I am. So thank you. Well, I appreciate that. Did you know that you can actually get a tank? Oh, hearse? fuck the tanks, man. No, bro, you can get a tank limo and you can get a tank hearse. A tank Imagine, limo? Bro, a tank hearse. Like, you could bro. die and be taken to your grave in, a, you put in your a tank. in that? Right. What if they just shoot you out the gun thing? Imagine just yeah. get shot into the <laughs> grave. Like, into the anyway, fucking sea. That, that, that's the end of my tank. <laughs> to be fair, that's if I was to die, I would prefer to get shot into the sea as far as possible rather than like just get absolutely buried. collided into the ocean. You what? know that won't like you won't fit through the barrel. No, we make a yeah, fat cunt. <laughs> no, right, not so like that. Guys, All right, friend. Josh, fuck it up. Getting fat shamed on the podcast, guys. We love it. Louis fucking gets fat shamed. That's a clip. Um, hey, when you die, you can't eat. So maybe you might shrink a little bit. Yeah, but no, like, I, I think we just get a bigger a bigger one. Or maybe we make it like, we put a funnel on the top. A, yeah. big, a really big funnel on the top. And I just sit in the funnel and then it goes boom. But are you pitching this idea to Josh right now for his channel? Yeah, like I sent a YouTuber into the ocean. Great. What a great video. <laughs> Lewis Buckingham getting just shot uh, in the ocean. In brackets, gone wrong, he's dead. <laughs> R.I.P. <laughs>